Caitlin Saxstrom with her idol, Annika Sorenstam. This for Birdie at the third, takes them to 10 under par. Began today. Both uh, the first day, an alternate shot seemed to have the fairway greens very well under control. But how about this for an escape shot? For a player who didn't have to escape very <laughs> often when she played. Back to that penultimate tea time, Matilda Castron. And with Kelly Tan, her good friend. Oh, oh with friends like that. <laughs> oh, great. So they join a the tie for second. This will just be a soft wedge. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Good read. Really nice read. Tried to escape. <laughs> And they pull within two. Head on, sort of keeps moving a little. This is a seven iron for Lizette. It's her, actually the first iron in her bag. It works. Mm -hmm. Beautiful. Let it go. And did. Another good read, another good stroke, another good birdie. Back to back, get some 13. Under par. Scotland grew up in Australia. Karis Davidson, a rookie on the LPGA Tour, just turned 24, playing with Daniela Darkea. Oh, oh, yes. She went down on two to get that to drop. And a good round in this alternate shot format yeah. to keep them. This is six iron. Kind of in a burnt out area of the rough. Thin to that one. Kind of a straight, low, thin shot. Oh, to As they win. say, thin to win. Uh -huh. Or at least to birdie. Maybe. That is a darn good miss right there. <laughs> Four. Seven, nine, seven, right side, I want to keep it just to the left of the hole. Or right there, it'll work too. Beautiful shot. Good chance for birdie here at nine. Hi. All right, left breaking putt here. Solid. Boy, that was it. Really nice putt taking advantage of that miss hit. Well, and just look at that scorecard. All pars and a birdie for a pair of players that likely have never been in this position before, holding the 36 hole lead, trying to get their. All right, Kelly Tan now pay off the shot. Castron hit in there and she snuck it in the left corner. It worked. It's a nice birdie at nine. That's a tricky hole location to get to. It's been a nice move today for. Elizabeth Silkel and this woman, Cheyenne Knight. And that birdie at 18 gives them the best score of the day, a 66 on this par 70. One now for birdie at 11. So Pat Limp's ball come back, and there you go. Came back to the right spot. Nice birdie. So they move within three. Three in a row. It gets down to the second shot. Tee shot's fairly straight. The wind blowing right to left, so she defied that by just hitting a pretty dead straight tee ball. Yeah, Tracer said that was a good one. I don't believe Tracer huh? could get down all the way to the bottom, get down to the flat, make a huge difference, avoid some of those little spots. All right, that'll be fine. Three at 11. Should go a little right to left, maybe. Woo! Oh, yeah, she knew it was in. <laughs> oh, yeah. And then, damn. Let me do 11 under. Short right's okay. Pin high right's not as good. Yeah, caught that solidly. Yeah, really good. Okay. I mean, that's that's exactly what she was looking for right there. Not much more she could do. Yeah, going to be tricky up and down. You have to you have a couple options bumping it, trying to go up in the air. Par four. Left her last attempt just short. Oh, yeah, just, just enough. enough. Yes. <laughs> They teamed up last year, played really well, played well again. <laughs> yeah, this is a much easier shot. Little downhill lie, that's a sand wedge. Coming in with a slightly lower trajectory and Beautiful. Oh, yeah. 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 good spin control too. Yeah, nice. Off a downhill lie, coming yeah. to soft greens to be able to. Went forward, leaning that shaft through. Oh, that was magnificent. That's pretty good. Yeah. A little easier from there. If that had been pin high, that's a lot tougher shot. I saw some pretty yeah. tough ones. Uh, here's Sydney Michaels playing with Mariah Stackhouse. They had a great run yesterday to make the cut. It's been a bit of a struggle today. But that would be a nice way to finish. Mariah says, I've got this.
Where he's at six, seven, and nine. Make the turn at three under. 14 under total. Fifteenth. Sacks from now. This is their fourth shot. They are kind of going backwards here right now. This would help. It does. Oh, All right. Sometimes the car's getting out of control there. Double back at 14. <laughs> Inch of rain fell. Tuesday night and Wednesday. This is the short 12th. It's Kelly Tan. Judge the spin beautifully. That to and that's like see how close she can hit it. Five. Oh, not her best. Yeah. Well, All right. yeah, that's about 20 by the hole. I don't think she's going to like that one. That was a little surprising. We thought she'd hit a little closer. Two way tie at the top. Too hard or tough on herself. I think that was one of the things early on watching her play in college. She'd get pretty tough on herself. And I would bet playing alongside Lizette Salas probably helped in that regard. A 12 footer to save par. Okay. Oh, center cut. Yeah, that's a good stroke. That'll calm you down a little bit. Yeah, that first bogey of the week came at 10, but good save there. Thanks, partner. Save me. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> you deserve a little back rub there. Okay, saves that for par. Still two way tie at the top at 14 under par. And there's no trees there now like there were when I was playing. Did you? I have us in plenty of those. This is really a great shot. They missed the opportunity last hole, but that looks like a pretty good <laughs> chance for save. She thought she had it. Ji Kang, now 31 years old. She was a teenager. She won on the Epson Tour back in 2008. 14th year on tour and playing with young Tiffany Chan and she's shot by Castron. Okay, it worked. So. Go to the 15. Yeah, paddling for birdie here. Just sneak up that leaderboard as well. It's gonna stay on line. It does. Nice cut. It's him to 11, just three back. Watch out. Got a tip from her husband, Jay Monahan, earlier in the year, and uh, putted lights out at the Chevron. Been putting great ever since. He's out here. He's a caddy for Allison Cruz these days. They're not watching. They'll settle for a par. Especially in this moment. I think we're going to see a lot from this player. She just has, you know, that X factor. I think she is emotional, intense, has fun, and she's very, very disciplined and driven to be a good player. Check. Kaylin Anderson, her coach at South Carolina, just was so high on her for obvious reasons. Check out her Instagram and see her doing her MMA her, training. Yeah, her cross training is, I, we talk about cross training with golf, you know, whether you go to the gym, you do yoga, you run, bike, swim. She kickboxes, and it is uh, an impressive workout to watch. I don't envy the bag, I can promise you that. Yeah, she it's... Gripping down on this a bit. Yeah. Oh, this is on the right line for sure, if it's not too much. Yeah, the tracer said it was good, it just needs to slow down. Down a little bit and really keep that club face square through impact. Yeah, got lined up right there at the right center of the green. That's where it started. There's that nope. flip. Yep. There's the pull and the. We all know that shot, don't we? And that gets you into some big trouble. Yeah, it's going to be big time trouble. Short sided. Upper body kind of took over. Lower body out of sync. To the 13. Yeah, you got to wonder. I mean, she's had a couple top 20s, but you get around all these people, as Pace said. Got to be some nerves right now. It's where you slow your mind down. It's a difficult part. They'll come off with a double bogey. Got a three shot swing. Yeah, it very well could be. Um, wow. As Cupcho is going to have an opportunity to make it two. And she's playing alongside Lizette. Well, that was that was a good stroke. Yeah, that's kind of a fall line there. That was that just it goes left. It's just it wasn't a bad putt. It doesn't appear that way. But when you... 
He takes us down the right side or left, given that this is back into the wind. Yeah, trying to take it left of the bunker. Yeah, that's a good tee shot right there. Strong. Yep, catch from second shot. Two shots back. A little above her feet. Downwind. All right, we've seen that putt. Good chance for Birdie. Couple good chances. Wow. It's been right. Ah. Nope, she wanted it on the right side. It's close, you know, in distance, but that's going to be a I said most of the scoring will happen tomorrow in the four ball portion. It's inch one step closer. To finish the day, that'd be a good one. Lizette playing a good amount of left to right break, almost a foot. Well done. Yes! That was not an easy putt by any means. They were three back when the day began. They, they've just made it look really easy today. They haven't been in any, any major trouble. She's got a good kick there. I don't think she hit it as solid as she would have liked. No, kind of necked that one, I think. Still, that's going to be. To be careful if it's not going past this whole location because the green kind of slopes away and back over the green. This has a good line. Oh, really? Yeah. How about that? Boy, are they relaxed and then. The yeah, this will be just a just a wedge. And a good opportunity. Try to get some positive momentum. Yeah, good line as well. All right. Okay. okay. Been unlucky it didn't go forward, but two good chances at birdie here at the 15th, but a three shot lead by and half holes. A little right to left and straightens out. Yeah. It's just what the doctor ordered. Yeah. Really nice putt. Absolutely. So that settles him down a little bit. To the left. Yeah, great stroke. Yeah. So any questions there have been answered. Five under on their round. Back to back birdies like they did in six and seven. Duan last November with an ace, won two year lease from Lamborghini. I called that one. And no ace, no Lamborghini, but a really good. Getting their groove back a little bit as we go to 17. KG King for birdie at 17. Did she hit it? She did! <laughs> Location kind of like the back center part of the green. Pretty accessible. Very accessible. Catch a beautiful shot in there. Good chance for Birdie. Room to get the 13 under. At 18, it's Tiffany Chan. But just being able to salvage bogey at 16 was big. Uh oh. Careful. Oh no. Job of keeping a square club face here, getting. She knew she was going to get height based on the uphill lie, trying to keep it as de lofted as possible without. Uh... And, and it's just a simple stroke. Oh, yes. Wow. She had the right arm. She knew. This she knew ready. it was five feet to go. About that. They stay bogey free for the day. They stay up by the way. Jeff's like, thanks, parts. Wind is helping on this hole. That might get some good turbo kick. Yeah, right towards the fairway bunker. Castro hit a beautiful shot in there. The 13, just three back. Forgiveness that uh, you don't usually give yourself. That's a great way to put it. And then much better swing yeah. there from Weber. She won't have to ask for forgiveness on that. That'll work. 18. And now Tiffany Chan for bogey. She put.
How about 16 and 18? They're going to go down as bogeys, but finding a way to get it in. <laughs> They're good bogeys. Just to ensure clearing the lip. Cut that a tad heavy, but it shouldn't hurt her too much. Yeah, yeah that's that's a good leave. Yeah, just to the front portion of the green. Long shot. Um. the L.E.T. to become Solheim eligible. Her son's second shot. Look, two teams in the top 13 are over par, and this is one of them. Nice to have a lob wedge in. Yeah, it's a uh, bit unlucky. It spun all the way back there at about 30 feet. Should be a tough putt, but I liked it a little bit closer. Four feet, 18 paces onto the green. It'll have left to right break and a little uphill. She did. Yes, she did. <laughs> So all poor out in plant room, they were making putts from everywhere. Wow, what a putt. Got a great read. Almost the same line. Got to go. All right, so they make par. It's the other way, James. A little disappointing with that length of putt. They'll head over to the 18th tee. Going to play this event as we said last year, but Castron, who cleans up for par, was asked by Katrina Matthew, the European Solheim Cup captain, would you go try to play in Europe and try to win on the LET and become eligible for my team? Well, she went not only to Europe, but the alternate shot format. Oh, nice. and just a smooth swing there. Smart shot out to the right as there's not much room left to the flag. Oh, no, she's pulled that. Solidly. Oh, the worst thing you could do. The perils of Pauline. And uh, Cupcho in her rookie campaign last year. For 63. That's going to be the best round of the two days of alternate shot, though. 64. Salas and Jennifer Cupcho. And their three shot deficit is going to be a four shot lead going into the fourth and final round tomorrow. Yeah, this is a down downhill putt, a 25 footer. Find it. Oh, almost did. So they double both 13 and 18 page. The two holes that parallel each other and share this lake. So we've got some bad mojo going on this whole this this stretch of the golf course for them.